What are you doing? I'm turning the floor into lava. Why are you doing that? Because we're playing the floor's lava challenge for 24 hours. Three, two, one, go. Oh, shoot. Ah! 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 Look at all this lava. Holy cow. Hey guys, how are you gonna get back to the content house? I need you to help me. How are you gonna get back to the content house? I have a path. Guys, the only thing I can think of is if either this nub or that nub comes and saves me or I have to jump to this thing. Dude, jump, send it. So people have been playing the floor's lava for years, but surprisingly, no one's ever tried to survive for 24 hours without touching the floor. This is our attempt to be the first. My first mission is to figure out how to save my friends. Come on, Chris, send it. Whoa. Oh my gosh, that was so scary. Parkour. Cannot believe that we're gonna be doing this for 24 hours. Please. Dude, my hair is getting so much right now. Now he's on the work truck. I may have dented the hood. Chris! Should I do it? This is a far jump. I think I might be able to do it. There's flowers in the way over there. This is sketchy, bro. How do you think I feel? Maybe I can find something in the car to help me. I need to knock that flower pot off the basket. Shoot. What are you doing, Chris? Ooh. I think I could make it to this tire, bro. Yeah? yeah? I know I could definitely clear the gap. It's a matter of does my foot slip? Do I land right? Sorry, plant. Nice. Whoa! Oh, I'm on the button. Hey, Chris made it. I have Chris, the plant. you just activated the world's largest mystery button. Oh, shoot. I feel like I could do it, dude. All right, go for it. Basket achieved. So at this point, I've calculated that I need three baskets to save my friends. Second basket achieved. I feel like I could so make it, but it's so far. Jeff, don't risk it, bro. I got help. I just need three baskets. Don't you dare do it, Jeff. I had to move very carefully here because these baskets were not made to be stood on and could break any second. Finally, I can step off of my original location. Now this basket be very careful. It's so dangy. You could lose the challenge because of this basket. Hey Ryan. Hey. What's up bro? Mission, save the friends, complete. Pass me the basket that's in the back. Good idea, Chris. So these crates are not meant to be stood on. One of them was super wobbly, but we were still successful in making it back to the content house using the crate method. I'm on a button. Chris, you just activated the second world's largest mystery button. Shut up. Get into the house. Is this stable? Dude, this thing's sketchy. <laughs> I'm just getting a chair, bro. Now that we're in the house, we have a list of counters to complete before the 24 hours is over. It's gonna be very difficult since we can't touch the ground. Oh! Okay, All right, so I'm the first one to the kitchen. Looks like we got some special K. Coming! Ryan was super creative when trying to avoid the lava, but this could end up being his downfall. This is fun. Who would want to do this? On the menu for breakfast this morning is eggs, pancakes, sausage, and cereal. This is actually a lot harder than it looks. Dude, what a delectable, delicious wreck face. I can't make it over the crack. Oh, my leg. So we can get around faster. Let's just make a track wherever we go, okay? Pass the items, me buckos. Nobody seemed to like my create a path idea, but pretty soon they're gonna realize that it helps a lot. If we're gonna successfully survive 24 hours, we have to think smart. One slip up and it's over. Okay, Ryan, if you can make it to Jeffrey's office, take the window off and screen. Well, we can step onto that. Okay. Getting onto the roof was an extremely difficult task, but we made it. The task we have to complete will continue getting harder, and there's even an elimination challenge. It actually feels quite nice to be up here because we're free to walk around. Dude, it's a know. laser gun! Shoot it! <laughs> Okay, well, our next task is downstairs, so we gotta figure out the best way to get down. Ryan used the big brain move and figured out how to get us off the roof safely, but it's gonna be difficult. Oh, good idea. Let's get that ladder. Put it on the leg. The loop de doo Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Wait a minute. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> We're gonna be on the good stacks. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah, we made it up and down the roof. This is a genius way to get down. Got the snakes! After doing this challenge for a few hours, I still have no idea how the heck I'm supposed to get home. All right, Gatorade, Gatorade. Oh my 
So the next challenge is airsoft hide and seek. We have five minutes to hide and 15 minutes to survive in our spot before the seeker finds us. If he finds us or we fall in the lava, then we lose. And get shot. My idea is to go into the treehouse. I don't think he's gonna go up to the treehouse with a giant gun. I'm gonna put on my jacket in case I get found and shot. I don't wanna leave a trail. It'll be really bad. I gotta get over there in less than five minutes. My spot is inside of here, the fireplace. I hope I can fit. I made it so and I didn't leave a trail. This is really difficult to get into this spot. Okay, back to the treehouse. The bridge is sketchy though, it's been here for so long. I don't know if the treehouse is safe. I gotta hide this crate though. I feel like I have the best spot. There's no way he's gonna find me. The other benefit of the treehouse is I don't think he's gonna climb up there. Close these a little bit. Now, just turn around. I don't trust the bridge anymore, dude. I gotta hurry or I'm getting shot out. I win! I knew this spot was good. I'm gonna come down now. Now we have to make our way over to the next task, which is the elimination bar hang challenge. This is the elimination challenge. One of us will be falling into the lava. So we'll be hanging from this pole, and no one is allowed to leave until someone falls in. Dang, what? Everybody grab onto the pole. Bro, this is scary. Pole grabbed. Three, two, one, go! Oh, this is... This is not too bad. My hands already kind of hurt. Oh, that thing kind of hurt. It's kind of the shape of the bar. Hurt. Oh, that hurts. I think I'm making myself swing. This hurts. <laughs> ah, this hurts. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. Oh. yes. Oh. Holy cow, dude. Chris, no. <laughs> we were sad that we lost Chris, but we had to finish the challenge. Wait, why is this a task we have to complete? You can't do much with a noodle. Well, now it's time to head home for the night. Ryan decided to try his luck at the content house, but as for me, I have to figure out how to get home to my wife and baby, which are miles away. It's gonna take about three hours? This is insanity! This is good news. My double chair method is working, but this will be one of my most difficult journeys home. One small step for me, one giant small... Wait, forget it. All these steps are small. But I decided to push onward and try my best. I owe it to Chris to complete the challenge so he didn't save us in vain. I made our way down our steep hill and I crossed the long dirt path and then I encountered my first major problem. The problem with this spot is that the legs keep sinking in the ground so we're actually almost to the street. Dude, I just got stabbed. Oh, dang it, I lost! <laughs> it took like 45 minutes to get from the house to this darn street anyway. There's no way I was gonna get home. Hopefully Ryan can make it to the morning because I couldn't. With the sun officially set, I'm feeling good. This challenge is no match for me and my mustache. I decided to taunt the floor by working out without even stepping foot on it. Oh, yeah. After a long day's work, it's time for bed. Good night. Upon waking up only a couple hours from finishing the challenge, I then realized I'm basically like Spider-Man. So my next challenge is I have to do the most epic Spider-Man pose. Five, four, three, two, one, zero! I did it! I did it. I survived 24 hours without touching the floor. I did it for Jeff, and I did it for Chris. But now I'll never leave the floor again, not even to jump. <laughs>